Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. This is Kasturi. I really hope you're doing well and thank you so much for clicking on this video. So I was randomly scrolling on Amazon when I saw this hair tool which looked literally like the Alan Truman glow brush. So I clicked onto it and then I saw the price. The price was literally one fourth of the Alan Truman one and that made me very curious to try it out. So I obviously ordered it and here I am with this video. I'm actually filming this after I've tried both the products. Can you tell which side is the Amazon one and which side is the Alan Truman one? Make a guess and continue watching this video to find out if you were right. So my hair is currently 80 to 90% dry and I'm so sorry that I look like a wet rat right now but trust me it's gonna get better so firstly I'm gonna get started with the Alan Truman blow brush this is what the box looks like it's a very clean and nice packaging I got this a few months back from Nika and I remember that I got it on some kind of a sale let me quickly check at what price I got it so the MRP for this is actually 3749 rupees and I got it for 2249 so that's quite a discount so this is what the actual blow brush looks like and here are the three heat settings and the off button. It's actually very lightweight so your hand won't get tired even if you have like very long and thick hair so that's a good thing. So I've decided to do this side with the Alan Truman one and I'll be doing this side with the Amazon blow brush. So as soon as you plug it in the light here turns blue and after that you can just rotate this in order to change it. Before getting started, I like to use a little bit of this Olaplex bonding oil. It helps your hair look shiny and it also protects it from heat damage. And I'm gonna be blow drying in the high setting. I'm not gonna set it or anything, I'm just gonna blow dry it right now. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, as you can see, my hair is completely dry right now and that took me around 2 minutes and 37 seconds which I think is pretty amazing and also it does not feel wet in the roots as well. Now let's unbox the one from Amazon. I actually haven't seen it myself as well so I'm really excited. Okay, so this is what it looks like. There's no specific brand mentioned or anything like that so that is kind of weird. But anyway, let's open it up and see. Okay, so it comes bubble wrapped like this. Oh wow, that actually looks very similar. Let me do a side-by-side -side comparison. Here's what they look like and I think that looks pretty similar except for the fact that this one kind of smells like burnt plastic and I haven't even used it yet. Also both the plugs are a little different. This one is from Alan Truman and the other one is from Amazon. I'm really amazed at how similar these two are because the price difference was definitely huge. This one was for $5.97 so the price difference is like really crazy. I'm really excited to try this out. I just hope that it turns on. Oh wow it does. So it has turned on as you can see the blue light but unlike the Alan Truman one the heat settings are not clearly visible. Okay now let's see the heat settings. So there's this visible wave in my hair for god knows what reason so let's see if it can fix that. I'm kind of scared but I think it's gonna be fine. I'm gonna use this one in the high setting as well. So this one took a little less time but I don't think that counts because my hair was almost dry. But does it work? Yes definitely because the hair looks straighter and it's literally all dry. It couldn't really fix this wave but I don't think even the Alan Truman one can. Well let's find out. I think it did kind of fix it. Now I'm gonna try and set the hair and as it's written here straightening and drying. So I'm hoping it works on dry hair as well. As you can see, I don't do much to set it, I just do these circular motions. And I honestly can't tell a difference between the two sides. I think both the products serve the purpose, they both do what they're supposed to do. I really don't think there's any difference at all to be honest. But since the one from Amazon does not have a brand name, it could be a little risky since it is an electronic appliance. Like when there's a brand name attached to it, then you're kind of sure that it's safe. And also the plasticky smell that I was talking about, I realized that even the Alan Truman one has that, but it's definitely 
definitely way lesser so yeah those are a few things to keep in mind and all in all I don't think either of them are a bad product you can just go ahead and choose whatever fits your requirement and what you're ready to compromise on the quality is definitely not something that you have to compromise on it's just the other things that I just mentioned so yeah that was the comparison between the Alan Truman blow brush and a random blow brush from Amazon if you ask me then yes the one from Amazon is definitely a good dupe if there's anything else you want me to review from Amazon then definitely leave it in the comments down below and yeah that was it for today's video I really hope you liked it and I hope that it was helpful for you if you like this video then please don't forget to leave a like and also do subscribe to my channel down below and I'll see you next time Thank you.